Wake up, sleepyhead. Come on. Wake up. Are you trying to keep me nice and comfortable so I'll shut up? Look, I know I'm nice and warm. But it's our turn to go out hunting, remember? Alright, alright. I'll cuddle with you just a little longer. But only because you're so cute. As much as I'd like to stay snuggling up with you all day, we can't let the little ones go hungry. Remember, you're not a cub anymore. In fact, you haven't been a cub for a while now. Just because you're my favorite doesn't mean that I can baby you forever. <laughs> There we go. Good girl. I know. I know. It looks like it's going to be raining soon. All the more reason we need to get going. I don't want anyone in the pride to go hungry over some silly rain. Everyone here depends on me. And rain or not, I'm going to make sure all of us get fed. First things first. It's important to make sure your claws are always sharp and ready for whatever you may run into. See this tree here? As you can tell, it's my favorite. Go ahead. I'll let you use it too. <laughs> I don't mind your scent being on my things. and sharp. Unfortunately for us, a lot of our prey are going to be finding shelter soon. It's gonna be tough, but I know I can count on you. Since you're still new to hunting, feel free to ask if you have any questions. What will we be hunting today? I'm not really sure. I don't think we have much room to be picky, considering the storm coming our way. <sighs> and there it is. I was hoping to get started a little sooner today. <sighs> 
I suppose I have no one else to blame but you. It's your fault for cuddling so close to me last night. Who could resist something so warm and soft? <laughs> I'm just joking. You don't need to apologize. No one can predict the weather, silly girl. We don't have much choice now but to wait for this rain to slow down. In the meantime, let's stay dry under this tree and chat, shall we? I'm sure you have other things you'd like to ask me. How long have I been part of the Pride? Come now, dear. You know it's bad manners to ask for a woman's age. Hmm. Let's see. It's been quite a while. So long, in fact, that I can't give you an exact time. I've seen many kings come and go. But what's always stayed the same is the love that I have for my family. And since you're a part of that family, I intend on loving you, too. How adorable. And here I thought you couldn't get any cuter. Now I've gone and made you blush. <laughs> it's true, though. I care very much about all of you. And that's exactly why I'm out here with you now. To make sure you know how to take care of yourself. You want to know if hunting can be dangerous? Of course. Hunting is always dangerous. Many see us lions as one of the strongest around. Which we are. But even we have our weaknesses. It's important to realize that weakness, and not let your pride, no pun intended, get the best of you. You don't think you have any weaknesses. <laughs> you really are a silly girl. What if I pushed you down like that? What's wrong? You realize now just how small you are when you're pinned down by someone much larger. Come on then. Show me just how strong of a lion you are. Show me just how much experience you have. Is that all? You know, if I really wanted to, I could just bring you back for dinner. You think I want to wait around in the rain all day? Don't look so scared. I'm just joking with you. I just finished telling you how much I love you, sweetie. I would never hurt you. I'm just trying to teach you a lesson is all. There, there. I was just showing you a bit of tough love. So don't be upset with me. You're a very good girl. A bit stubborn. But a good girl nonetheless. Some things you need to learn for yourself in this world. But if I can prevent you from getting hurt, then giving you a little scare is worth it. Since I'm here anyway, let me snuggle up in that warm fur of yours while we wait for the rain to stop.
As I was saying, there's a reason why we typically hunt in groups. It's much more efficient and safer that way. Sure, a zebra or gazelle may not look threatening, but every animal has an instinct to live. See the scar on my cheek? I was foolish enough to think that I could take something on my own. It's a reminder that we all need help, and to never let myself make the same mistake twice. Speaking of help, do you see that group of hyenas out in the distance? Looks like they sniffed something out. What was that? Do I intend on taking their food? Of course I do. Why wouldn't I? You think it seems like the lazy way out. <laughs> Perhaps you're right. But as I said, hunting is more than just showing off how strong you are. It's about being smart and realizing what's important. For me, Feeding my family is the most important thing. And if that means stealing from a group of cackling hyenas, then so be it. Lucky for us, the rain makes it perfect for sneaking and stealing. <laughs> Let's go, kitten. I still have a lot more I need to teach you. <laughs> 